Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's been a while, a lot of things have happened since I made my last video. I have the whole coronavirus thing going on. And so like I said, I'm gonna be doing um, some eyeshadow. Today is the weather mile. So I'm gonna be doing a green look, hopefully. My hubby's cleaning out the garage, so if you hear his music, please disregard it. So I'm gonna go ahead and start off by doing my eyebrows. This one is supposed to be soft brown. Oh, you should kind of use it. So tempted to shave off my eyebrow like everybody else is doing. And like making a whole new brow. So tempted to do it. They shut down everything, so I wasn't able to cut hair or anything like that. Which I don't have a salon or anything, but I had a lot of people asking me for haircuts. And I was like, you guys, I can't cut hair. I can't do anything because I don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> But um, supposedly they're supposed to lift that this Friday. I really need my nails done. I had bought myself a nail kit, but um, my nails fell off because I broke them. And so once I break one, I have to take them all off. That's just me. I don't know if that's y'all too, but that's how I, I've always been that way. And my hubby has always hated that. This stuff is like really, I think they changed the formula because it's drying a lot quicker than my outfits haven't been anywhere besides outside and that's it or to their grandma's house they haven't been at no stores or anything like that because we won't allow it i mean even though me and jose go out we're still putting our kids at risk by going out to the store and then coming home so it's like what can you do your hands are tied no matter what I'm just going to moisturize my face so how i've been keeping up with my face facial hair is i've been using these blades that i purchased from cvs they are super sharp blades that you have to be careful with because if not, you will cut yourself. Wow, like a three pack for five dollars. Ask you yes. So that put the good. I'm gonna go in now with this CoverGirl concealer, just like this, and I'm gonna outline my brows. Can you bring me a cleaner for my the mirror? Cause it, this little mirror looks ridiculous. The A Windex. You know the yellow color. Anyway, so now that Jose is not working, he's home with us and it has been a wonderful experience having him home. Christian really enjoys his daddy being home. You know, he's so young and he, he doesn't really understand why his dad leaves. I mean, I, I'm really grateful that he doesn't have to leave. But at the same time, like he doesn't have a job. Like this is super hard for our family and it's super hard for all the other families out there that lost their jobs and you know like I said, i've been so uninspired lately and i told myself it's time to get out of that ruckus and go i'm gonna blend it out using a lime green color this is the same one that's in the dreams charles palette and i'm using a bigger fluffier brush i'm just gonna top off the excess of it and i'm gonna go above it and blend it out first i'm just tapping it on there right here right above it and then I'll okay so now that I got that green on there I'm gonna cut my crease I'm gonna take off the shadow I have on here though use a q-tip to take off the extra makeup that you don't need that you're gonna cut your creases and i'm gonna go in with the white cut creaser okay so i'm gonna use the abh eye primer okay now i'm gonna go to the <laughs> jacqueline hill palette and use that one red <laughs> because i want to use this palette but um but with the look i was doing today i, I didn't have a green in it so oh wow If this thing is my eyelids do this, I'm not going to do that. Just packing that red in there like that. Then I'm going to go back in with that dark green. Oh, this one's a bit green. Okay, 
And then go back in with that white brush again to blend that out. Red again. Take off the excess red and then use that same brush to blend it into the white. Like that. Then I'm gonna take some eyeliner and line it out. Okay, and then I'm gonna take some concealer and make that wing sharp. What is your daddy doing, Christian? Is he cleaning? Then I'm gonna make this sharp. And I'm gonna use an eyeliner brush to do my glitter. And there is the first eye. I'm gonna re-blend the top and then do the other eye and I will be right back. I am now done with my Eyeshadow. I'm going to be doing the rest of my face. I'm gonna use the thing mascara. Okay, so I did already apply my foundation. I used the I uh, the Il Maquillage foundation, and I'm gonna put some concealer on now. I'm gonna be using the CoverGirl True Blend Concealer. This is in the shade Buff Beige, and I'm just gonna apply. This is a little bit dark on the darker side. Oh my eyelashes. And I totally forgot. It's not hot. It's kind of cool. I got 16,000 likes on my video. Already? That's good. I'm doing that move. Babe, come here. Up, <laughs> what am I doing? Laura Mercier translucent powder and I finally got it. I'm rich now. I'm not rich. And I'm just gonna push that underneath my eye here. So I like to look up and see like where um my like where I would want my nose. And I could kind of like, I don't know, it's like, a, it's weird how I see it. But I do like a little line, like circular line like this. Kind of like a crescent, like that. Then I do the bottom, like right underneath it, where I want the pointiness to it. Like that. So now it creates like this button nose. Then I'm gonna make this line thinner here. Then I do go over my nose, so I kind of like blend in that, blend it in so it doesn't look stupid. <laughs> this is Undercover by Buxom. So 
guys that is the 